What is good everybody? Welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. I have a very special figure clothing haul in this envelope for you guys today. I'm going to be showing you the shirts that I got made and then putting them on the figures to show you. I ordered these specifically for my pick fed. I didn't want my guys to have shirts like they have in real life. Some of them are like the ones they have in real life, but I wanted to have some of them be custom made to fit in my pick fed so I went ahead and got those designs made and then got them ordered for figure clothing so let's go ahead and get straight into the envelope. Alright guys so this envelope should be pretty easy to rip open I should just be able to just tear it right off and I can so that's really awesome and then we'll just dump it out right here and there we go that's all of them so we can get that out of the ring there they go alright so I guess we'll just start with this baggie since it's got my custom referee shirts so I have three referee shirts for each brand and here's the vindication one it is blue and as you can see it says vindication right there on the chest and then MDT on the sleeve right there I think these are really really awesome so I will have three of those for three different refs for different matches so you don't have to see the same FN referee in each match and then for the other brand we have MDT live and it's just a black shirt with the MDT live logo right there and then the MDT there so that's those referee shirts. I wanted three for each, like I said, because I did not want the same referee to do every single match. That's exhausting, even for a figure referee. So those are over there. And then getting into the other baggie, these are for individual superstars. So we'll dump these out. The first one is for Edge. I wanted a shirt that he has not worn. So I just sort of threw his Rated R Superstar logo on a black shirt and called it a day. So that was pretty cool. I like that logo a lot. And I needed like a t-shirt for him to wear for promos, backstage segments, stuff like that. So I picked that one up. The next one is Cesaro and it says Swiss Superman. I found this logo online and I was just like, that looks awesome. I think that'd look great on a t-shirt. And I decided to put it on red just because I think it fits Cesaro well. So I went ahead and got that one made for the same reason I had the Edge one made. And this one is for Seth Rollins. I didn't have a t-shirt for my Seth Rollins. So I went ahead and got this one made. I know he has this in real life, but... I like this t-shirt design and I think it'll work pretty good. The next one is for RVD. As you can see it says RV, RV F and D. And I just love this t-shirt design and obviously WWE would not print this so I was like might as well put it in my pick fed. I think this will look really awesome on the Elite RVD figure. Um, here we have the Sandman cutoff shirt. I have this to go on my custom Elite Sandman that I made the other day. Big fan of the Sandman. I think I'm going to put him in my pick fed so you guys can look forward to that. I really like this shirt design and I look forward to seeing what that looks like when it's complete. And then the last two are two cutoff shirts. This one is for Bobby Lashley. It says Seek and Destroy and it's like that Ryback or Big Cast type shirt. And it's like a, I forget what they call them, but it's like a big guys usually wear them. And, um,. I just like this t-shirt a lot. It says Seek and Destroy and it's got Bobby Lashley right there with like a little reticle. And I think that looks really, really awesome. Love the way that looks. So I'll put that on my custom Bobby Lashley. And then I have this final one is for Jeff Hardy. Same cutoff style. I think, you know, it'd be really cool for him to wear to the ring during his matches. So I picked this one up, just threw his uh, him and Matt's logo on there with the purple and green colorway. And I will put this on my custom Elite Jeff Hardy that is not here yet. So unfortunately, I cannot put this on anything. But I think it'll look really awesome once it does get here. And I will put that on a video, obviously. So that is all the t-shirts. So what I'm going to do is get each individual figure in here and put all these shirts on there. And then we will get into it. So, so up first, we have Bobby Lashley in his Seek and Destroy shirt. And I think this looks really, really awesome. Being a bigger guy, I think it only makes sense if he were to wear a cutoff shirt like this. Like the, again, like we stated, the Ryback style. I think that looks really, really awesome. I just found that logo online, threw it on a shirt, and I thought it would look really, really good for the pick fed. So there is Bobby Lashley. Up next, we have Sandman. This is a complete custom elite Sandman. I love the way this looks. I hand drew on his barbed wire tat right there on his right arm and then used a Stone Cold Steve Austin. WrestleMania Elite, I believe, and threw on a Jack Sandman head with the custom shirt. And there you have a custom Elite Sandman, which is now complete thanks to this shirt. Looks really, really awesome. Love that a lot. We'll have to post him with the kendo stick. Then up next, we have Cesaro. I think this one looks absolutely amazing. I love the custom logo there. The Swiss Superman logo looks awesome. I love it. The red on red looks really good, and the shirt fits him very, very well. This is a total custom Elite Cesaro, I threw on some different lower legs 
and threw on the big knee pads, put on some bigger arms, and I think this is a very good current day Cesaro, and it would work really well in the pick fed. So that is Cesaro. Then up next we have Seth Rollins in his black t-shirt. I think this looks really awesome on this fix-up Seth Rollins. This is more of a current Seth Rollins since we haven't had an updated one since Elite 45, and that one was from a while back. So I really like this Seth Rollins a lot. I think it totally completes it now with the t-shirt on there. And yeah, there's not much to say about Seth Rollins. Then up next we have RVD in his RV F and D shirt. I think this looks absolutely amazing as well. It again fits him really, really nicely. All these t-shirts are made perfectly. They fit awesome. And I love the way this looks. I think this will look great during promos and backstage segments as we've talked about before. But I just wanted his shirt to have some edge to it. So I went with that um, decal right there. And then for the last shirt we have, it is the Edge one. And I think I'm going to make an Edge in jeans and maybe a uh, beanie hat to put this shirt on instead of his wrestling attire. But still like the way this looks. Again, fits really, really nice. The logo looks great. All the logos on these shirts look very, very clean. Love the way each individual one looks. Let's see if we can get a shot with some of them in there. But... I love the way all of these shirts look. I think they work really, really well. They fit really nicely, and I'm very happy to have all of these. I think that's going to do it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will leave a link in the description below where you can contact the guy who made these shirts for me. Leave a like. Leave a comment on what you think about these t-shirts. Subscribe for more epic WWE figure-related videos, and I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.